Hello all, welcome to the ANSYS tutorials. In this video, I am going to show you how to conduct the fatigue stress analysis on a stepped bar. So this is the given geometry and uh, the stepped bar is fixed at the left side and it is sub subjected to a fully reversed transverse load of 1000 Newton. We are going to find out the equivalent alternative stress and the safety factor. Open ANSYS workbench. Choose static structural as the analysis type. I am not going to change the material, so I am uh, continuing with the predefined material. In the geometry, right click on that, choose import geometry, select browse and import the stepped bar as an IGS file. Next right click on the model and choose edit. First right click on the mesh and choose generate mesh. Next to apply the boundary conditions, right click on the static structural, choose insert and select the fixed support. Now select this edge and click apply. Next right click on the static structural, choose insert and here I am going to insert a force. So choose the force, now choose the right side edge, click apply. We know that we have two types of loads, one is vector and another one is component. So I am choosing component and I am applying a load in the y direction. And the magnitude of the load is 1000 Newton. Now right click on the solution, choose insert, go to fatigue and insert the fatigue tool. So once you click the fatigue tool, you will have many options here. So one is fatigue strength factor KF. So in our case, there is no KF is mentioned. So I am proceeding with the one. Then in the type, type of loading, we have uh, fully reversed then zero based. Zero based means it will start from zero, not exactly zero, somehow around the zero then ratio means we can provide some ratio between the maximum and minimum value star data means we can provide the trend of the curve so i am continuing with the fully reversed and i am going to find out the stress life so you can choose stress life or the strain life now in the stress component there are standard theories are available so i am choosing equivalent von Mises stress. Now right click on the fatigue tool and select insert and I want equivalent alternating stress. Also I need life and I am also inserting the safety factor. Now right click on the solution and click solve. So you can click the equivalent alternating stress and the maximum stress is of 6.28 e power 7 pascal and you can animate like this then if you choose life then the life is 1 into e power 6 cycles that is endurance life then in the safety factor factor you can see that the maximum factor of safety is 15 and the minimum is 1.375 which means that it is safe for the applied load. So if it is less than 1 then the design is not safe. So you can animate this. So to see the save the results you can choose images then image to file and you can save it. Thank you.